Mayor Rahm Emanuel's push for tougher penalties against repeat gun offenders is in trouble in Springfield. And state's attorney Kim Fox believed that's the wrong focus for attacking violent crime. CBS2 political reporter Derek Blakely has the story. State's attorney Kim Fox didn't reject Mayor Emanuel's proposed gun legislation, but says it's the influx of guns into Chicago that no one wants to address. It is an accepted reality that here in Cook County, we have twice as many guns as New York and Los Angeles combined, and yet we've done nothing about the flow of guns in Cook County with any meaningful legislation. Legislation pending in Springfield, which police superintendent Eddie Johnson supported in testimony last week, need to pay a price, would give more prison time for repeat gun offenders. While it may be challenging, we can still get this done, and I'm not going to give up fighting for it. But Republicans don't like reduced sentences for some drug offenses included in that package, a trade off a manual defendant. I think that's a proper balance. Our criminal justice system should be focused on violent criminals and away from minor offenses as it relates to narcotics. Instead, Fox touts her gun crime strategies unit. Building cases from the ground up. County prosecutors embedded with Chicago cops, along with federal agents and prosecutors in Chicago's violent Inglewood and Harrison police districts. With a targeted strategy of going after those who are doing the most harm. And she insists there's too much complacency about the illegal gun trade. Make it a full frontal assault on those who are trafficking in guns in the same level of priority as those who are shooting guns. That's the same argument some black lawmakers have made in Springfield. They oppose the repeat gun offenders bill, saying it lets the big guys, the illegal gun traffickers, off the hook. Reporting live from the newsroom, Derek Blakely, CBS2 News. Rob? Okay, thank you, Derek.